This is Cunningham Outdoors. Hey folks, this is Rich for Cunningham Outdoors. Hey, we got a real special treat for you this coming up this fall. Uh, We're gonna be going on a live bear hunt uh, this fall. Uh, we're gonna be going with uh, some friends of mine that I knew their, their kids from the Dark Boys and Girls Club when I was a director there. Uh, since I retired, they've had a couple bear tags and uh, they got one coming up this fall. So we're gonna be interviewing one of their daughters, it's the Marks family. We're gonna be interviewing them a, a little bit this afternoon, uh, kind of find out where they're hunting, how many bear tags they've had, how they do the hunting, and I believe they do it with dogs, what kind of weapon they use. So we're gonna sit down and we're gonna kind of explore and, and see what's gonna be going on. But we're gonna actually gonna be going, uh, talking to the daughter today, I think it's Kiana, hope I got that right. And we're gonna, find out a little bit about her preparation and what they're doing for this hunt. And we're gonna be going this fall on live. We're gonna go see her today, like I said. Then we're gonna go on, a, on one of the outings where they do the training with the dogs and then they actually go on the live hunt. So stay tuned for Cunningham Outdoors on a live bear hunt. Should be really fun for this fall here on Cunningham Outdoors. Hey folks, this is Rich for Cunningham Outdoors and we are with Kiana Marks today. This is the girl that's going to be ended up, I should say woman now, she's like 17 years old already. I, I remember having her uh, at the club when I was there, so it's real nice to see you here Kiana today. How many years have you been hunting? Um, my family has hunted like my whole life, but I, we always, I never really went with. I stayed home with my mom and like at my great grandma's house and went to my grandma's. And then when the Rona happened, everything got shut down and we couldn't do anything. And my sister got a tag donated to her. So then we went bear hunting all the time because that was something that we could, could do. Well, that's <laughs> cause cool. Because we couldn't do anything else. And how many, how many bear tags have you actually had yourself? This is my first one. Your first one. And you've gone on how many bear hunts? A lot. A lot? Yes. Well, that's really cool. That That's really good heritage to have with your family. Okay, Kiana, what part, are, are you hunting in Wisconsin? Yeah, up north. Up north, are you like about the Marinette County area? Yep. And what is your weapon of choice that you like to use? 30-30. 30-30. And like how often do you actually practice shooting a 30-30? Um, I haven't yet. <laughs> <laughs> Our family is a uh, last minute. One thing I wanted to show you folks is this here is a bear that they've had mounted that his, her, her sister has shot. Now is this your younger or older sister? Yeah. Your younger sister shot this bear about 315 pounds. That is just a beautiful animal. So this is really exciting and, and you're gonna be on the, the Cunningham Outdoors uh, video once we get this all put together. What is some of the preparation you do for to get ready for this bear? On Tuesdays and Thursdays, we go with like all of our buddies that we hunt with and we run the dogs to train them in July and August and then in kill season, they're all ready to go for September. Okay, Kiana, what are you looking forward to the most of this hunt coming up? Shooting a bear and all of the memories that we'll make. And it looked like you guys have a pretty good hunting party from what I've seen on, oh, yeah. on some other videos. So that's really cool. Mm -hmm. So last, did you go on a past bear hunt last year with anybody? Yeah, we got a lot of bears last year. I think we got seven of them. Holy cow, seven year, bears. Right? And you do this with dogs, correct? Yeah. So they go on Tuesdays and Thursdays about four o'clock. They go run the dogs for practice. And then when is your actual bear hunt? Like, do you, do you know what the date is of it in September? Um, September, the beginning to the end, like the first day to the last day, I think. Something and I think like that, that I'm not sure, I haven't looked myself to see if the dogs go first before the baiters this year. I, believe they, I think they do, I'm not sure. We'll have, to look, we'll have to look into it. Well, this has been really good, Kiana. The next time we, we sit down and, and talk to you, we're going to be going with your family and running these dogs. It probably will be a Thursday night that I'll come along. So we're looking forward to this. I'm very excited to see what we're going to 
for me to go on my very first bear hunt with dogs, it's gonna be interesting because I've done a lot of bait hunting, but I'm looking forward to see how this works with the bears. So we're excited, Kiana. So good luck to you for this year's uh, 2022 bear hunt. Thank you. Well, folks, here we are. We are driving around now. We got the dogs in the back and this is Ryan's little GPS thing that'll tell you the dogs, like where they are, how many times they're barking, where they're actually filtering through. It's just kind of a neat little gadget once we let the dogs out. We got Kiana in the back. She's our bear hunter this year. And in a little while here, we're gonna be putting, putting the dogs out to see if we can't get on a bear. We did have a bear run across the road on 64 right in front of us, but I didn't have a phone out or a camera going. But we'll see you in a little bit. We'll get things going here. <laughs> so right now we're tracking the dogs on the on the garment. <laughs> you can see which dog's barking and which dog's leading. <laughs> we are out, the dogs have been running back and forth across the road. We don't think they're on a bear though. Set. Oh, there was one? Oh, yeah. So, so this is where we are now. These are the roads. There's no roads this way. <laughs> <laughs> ay, ay, ay. I saw its beady eyes. Did ya? Yeah, yeah, but I don't know if I got it on the camera. Well, we made it out of the woods. Out of the woods. <clears throat> Dogs and all. We made it. Nothing banged up. Look at this. Look at this, folks. This is what the dogs need after that long trail. We went about 450 yards into the woods to find the dogs that were on the bear that they got up in the tree. And they were tracking, how many miles do you think they went, or total? Total? You'll cry, ain't it? Probably almost two miles. Three or four. Three or four miles these dog tracked that bear. Good boy dogs, good boy. Hey folks, this is Rich for Cunningham Outdoors. Uh, I'm about to get ready to go on my second dog run uh, for this bear hunt that we're hoping to videotape this fall. Uh, we had one in and then I, I had a little mishap. I had a, kind of a, a hip injury with a sciatic nerve, so I was down for a good week and a half. So I missed the last run, a couple runs they went on, but we're going out tonight. So when we get there, we'll hopefully have some footage for you for here, 
for this bear hunt this fall for Kiana Marks. So we're getting ready for the second bear run. So stay with us. Here we go guys, we're, we're hoping the dogs are on a bear, so we're going in. Actually gonna get some daylight hours for, for this time, but we got the dogs barking, so we're hoping they're on a bear. Okay, we're making our way back out of the woods already. Oh, we just got done with that first run. They're all putting the dogs in now and making a plan. To, I think they're gonna go and try and get on one more before the, the night's young. Uh, but that was cool to finally get it during the day. I'll tell you, it's hot. I am sweating my bananas off here. Very warm. Um, so we'll see if we get on one, but otherwise we got some finally got some good day footage of getting the getting the bear during the day. That was cool. Dogs did a lot of work. This guy's got seven dogs and he's got five tonight with them. So we'll see if we get on some more yet tonight here in Cunningham Outdoors for the dog bear hunt. Hey folks, that was really something cool to see Kiana getting her first bear for her first bear hunt. But before we get into that, I just wanted to tell you a little bit about hunting with the dogs. It is a lot of work and it's hard, it's expensive. You know, there's two ways you can hunt bear in Wisconsin, with bait and with dogs, and they're both legal. And I know some people kind of have differences about hunting with dogs, but I'll tell you what, that was my first experience doing it. It was so cool, neat experience how hard those dogs work, how much money it costs to keep those dogs going, and just to go out and, and kind of see what that experience is it's like. If you've never done it, you gotta try it. There's nothing wrong with hunting uh, bear with the dogs, and it's really cool, it's just a lot of work. But Kiana, congratulations, that was great. I didn't actually get to go on the actual hunt day, because I had COVID, that really stunk. But I at least got 
somebody to do some of the footage so we can put everything together and have this tape for you so you'll be able to enjoy that then. And I'm, I'm just so glad that everything worked out for her. So congratulations, Ken, on, on your first bear hunt. And this has been Cunningham Outdoors for this whole bear season for the for the fall of 2022. Again, congratulations to Kiana. And we'll see you during the bowl season here on Cunningham Outdoors. Smash the like button, turn on that bell, and subscribe to Cunningham Outdoors.